DJ Sharp MC. Bye. 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 Back on the track. So I loaded some sounds. Try to find a beat. Um, maybe we'll take that one up to one twenty five. at 125 go figure all right so let's try to drop it in sounds like it's uh should be on the downbeat like the way that sounds with a full loop. Let's see if we can do a short one. Let's loop it. Uh, maybe here. So if we go there. Edit on one key and then have to switch keys. Maybe I'll record that first part over because it doesn't kind of go with the beat. All right, let's uh, let's try something. Let's keep you as the drum. And let's re-record this first piece, which I think is right here. Hmm. So let's edit it. Oh, the timing is 155. That's why.
So do we come here and turn this to 125? That's not it. So go back to main. The sound is here. Put it on warp. 125. All right, let's uh, listen to the beat again. Mute this and see. All right, I don't know if it'll go, especially at that speed. So I need to slow it down. All right, so let's take the warp off. And then come back here. Warp is off. And uh, edit the sound to slower speed. So detect. Yeah, detect the speed. So it's at 58 according to the NPC. So then I guess what I would do is time stretch it, warp, warp, and then bring this to 125. If I want it slower. Wow. Um, okay, let's hear the beat. So it doesn't go as is. Let's do... Let's play it and just see what comes out. It doesn't go with that beat, so I'm going to mute you for now, and we'll find a different sound for that beat. Find a different sound. That stab could go, I think. I think if I take that drum beat and use a different part of it. That might take that sound there and let's let's loop it maybe from here. Let's try let's try looping it in a different place. Listen to the whole thing. Maybe I can find a different part. All right, so we'll try maybe from here. And then loop it to here. No, no, not right now. You'll hear a little bit of that click. Okay, that takes care of that side of it. Then for this side. So what if we do forward and reverse? What about backwards? Hmm, kind of interesting. Forward only. 
Marketing. All right, we're going to re-record it with this loop on. Didn't do the loop, but let's listen to it first and then we'll decide if we want to change it. That's the one I edited. It doesn't sound like it is. That's pretty clean. It's hmm. I wonder how you refresh that loop. Sitting in the settings. One shot. Q preview. Splice preview. Auto scroll. All right. So. That's the new edit. This one doesn't sound like it's updated. So how do we fix that? Uh, I need to refresh that sound. Well, I guess I could clear it out and then put it back in. So erase the track, clear, clear the current track. Yep. And then. I don't think that's it. It's not. All right, so I need to put that. Let's. I have an empty pad right here. That's bank one. I have an empty pad. I think on bank two. Empty pad on bank two. Right. I have an empty pad on twelve A of sound two. So now let's take this sample. Oops, let's go back to where we were. Sound one. Sound one. There's the sound. Sample edit. Process. So it's not oh I could I could reprocess it. That could work. Alright, before we reprocess it, let's try to move it. So I have the sound where I want it. And Loop, trim, lock, process. Well, I can only process it. <clears throat> All right, let's process it. Since discard everything else, then go back to main and see if it's changed. It's cut, but it's not changed. Okay, so then the sound is here in my sample edit. What are our choices? Program, assign. Oh, assign. Duh. Assign slice to pad. Sound to A12. Uh, non destructive. Do it. Wow, that took a minute. Okay, so here's the original. Okay, and then on my number 212. That's the one I, I edited. That's a lot of work, dude. But we got it. All right, so let's re-record the drum. And let's see if that if I can play that first pad loop. And then I'll try to bring it in here and go. All right, let's see if we can do it. All right, let's see if it loops. Wow, it's a lot of work. Interesting, uh, interesting sequence this time. All right, so we got that piece, we got that piece, and then what was on track three? Anything? Nope, nothing. Okay. All right, so um, I kind of like that drum beat, but I think doing it in reverse all the time ain't going to work. 
So, let's see what the original sounds like. And now let's see if we can clean this one up since it turned out to be a party. You're not going to loop for me? Oh man, why are you being all hateful? Um, <coughs> trim. <coughs> it's on the loop. So I have a non-destructive slice, so I wonder if I go here, get that one, hit sample edit, and it looks like it's the same sample. That looks almost exactly the same as this one. But this one's not looping. So if I take the loop lock off, and go like this. Oh, I can't, I probably can't mess with it. All right, let's find out anyway. Hmm. Let's see if I messed up the other one. I hope I didn't, but let's find out. It did. Wow. So we got a undo, undo. Okay, did I undo too much? Let's go back to here. Oh, I totally messed it up. That sucks. All right. Let's see if I can get it back to where it was. Well, at least I got it back to where it was almost. I had it on, um, I think I had it on reversing. Because that reverse sounded good, but I can't, probably can't start with that reverse. All right, all that work just to get that little bit of effort. I should put a clock somewhere so I don't run out of time. Need some more sound. Maybe that bass. That goes kind of. Are those on note on? They're one shot. Um, maybe I can just drop them in. Yeah, it's a nice little effect sound. Nothing, nothing big, but I think it can ride in the background. All right, so from here. Can't give up. Let's see what else we can do. That sounds pretty good right there, those two. Those two like that. So let's go here. Mute it. Go back to here. And we'll try to bring those in. Alright, so I think that makes a good second effect. Okay, um... Look at that. A little bit of a little bit of that sound.
maybe. All right, let's try it. Effect number three, so I got plenty of effects. I don't, I don't really like that drum beat as a lead. I think it makes a good transition beat, but I might have to build my own, my own drum pattern. sound kind of good. Maybe those two. That's a good background beat right there. Back pad. That's a really good back pad. That's almost a better back pad than the rest of the stuff going on. Let me say... And then let's uh, turn off the effect in the original pad and see how this sounds. Let's see if there's another. Backtracks, back, track, two. All right, so let's just check this out. Check this out real quick. changes. Uh, let's see how they sound with the effects on. Okay, those two go. What about these? Okay, what about this one? So that one doesn't go. What about this one? So the back pads don't go with the other pieces, but they're pretty good on their own. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep them for now. The back tracks are pretty strong. Okay. Um, maybe that for court. Yeah, maybe that for court. Not a bad little chord riff. So those really make my current beat sound pretty good, better than I thought. 
So now I gotta replace those drums or come up with an alternate drum pattern. What's this sound like? Tune it down, maybe? You tune it up? It's too fast. I kind of like it, but I need to do some serious work on it to make it go with the beat. Um, let's turn on this riff. And then see if we can make it fit. Where'd it go? Alright, I'm gonna discard everybody else. And let's put an effect on it. Uh maybe a harmonic frequency shift shift Multi-chorus. Yeah, we'll keep the multi-chorus because that just adds a little bit of flavor to it. Now I guess we need a compressor or something. Uh, let's see if filter gate will work. Let's check them out. Turn up the knees. 
ratio, maybe? Turn down that output. Okay, I think that's the desired effect. Let's see if I can drop it in. comes in too soon, so maybe I'll drop it in the middle or something. time in the background. It's a lot of work to get a, a little background stab. Effect. Noise. That's a lot of work for a little bit of an effect. <laughs> but at least you get to see what it's like, so that's cool. Alright, um I still want to do a different doing a different drum kit. Maybe that, like that. Yep, that's a good little hat in the background. I think those hats actually work. So if I take that effect off. Maybe add some uh, echo to this. I would have to add echo to those two. Uh... All right, so this will be the first time I try to add echo to two at the same time. So edit, multiple, this one, this one, and this one, those two, close, effect, uh, delay reverb, air delay. <laughs> Yep. All right. 
So that worked. That was cool. Figured that one out. All right. <laughs> Now we just need to fix that kick or come up with a kick. There was a kick sound on one of these pads. There. That sound. It's kind of long, so if we. filter on it. sounds better without that. Yeah, I think it sounds better without it. All right, uh, let's try to drop it in. Hmm. All right, let's see what comes out. Kind of goes as a good ghost kick. Makes me think it uh, it could stay. All right, so now I need a snare or a clap. Where's my snare kit? I like that snare. Okay, so we have that snare, and it's coming in kind of strong. So let's uh. That part sounds pretty good. Let's say it's been doing a lot of editing. And we're at 30 minutes in, so it's not too bad. Now I want to tone it down. Oh, I can do a, do it from the master. Let's do semitone, right? Still comes out a little high. Uh, let's go to the filter. Uh, let's try 16 level. So 
16 level velocity close. Something like that, maybe. Uh, I kind of like it, but I think it might be a little bit much. So maybe we'll make this snare two. And I'll do a different snare a little bit less often. All right, I think that I think that works for a beat. A little mellower than I like, but. I'm always doing fast beat, so maybe it's time to do a slow beat. Okay, so I got my snare, I got my hats, I got my ghost kick, I got my drum. Maybe I'll do a different drum. Different drum off of this. Where's my, my sound? Oh, 16 level. I hate forgetting that part. That's all right, I need to find a different drum kit anyway. Those. Mm, all right, let's try it. Oh, I should do sixteen level. Uh, maybe we'll do sixteen level tune. Something like that. Drum ride, drum beat, two. If I do that, then I can do a drum ride on the on a, on a hat. I can do a drum ride on a hat or a cymbal, and it'll give me a little variation. that. Try um, 
something from my I need a bass too. B -b 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 boy, we are your future. Watch me dance. We are, yeah. Keep on getting deep. Future. We can do. We are your future. MC DJ Drum. Don't stop. DJ Electro Boogie Electro Boogie Yeah, I think maybe a a bass sound. Oh, I could do that clock too, but let's find a bass sound first. That one, maybe? 16 level? That's complicated. Ooh, let's try it. Let's see if it works. I think that goes kick out. for me and I think if I go to my guitar effects maybe I can really turn that into something useful uh, my guitar effects are harmonics tube drive let's try it oh, um, I'm still on 16 level and I'm gonna have to do the whole I'm gonna have to do the whole pad Oh, actually, I'll just do the one pad. Yeah. So did I do this one by mistake? No. Nope. Oh, I did. Take that off. So we, we'll do that one pad. Put it in that one pad. And it was too dry. All right, let's try it. It's really enhancing it. Uh, maybe talk box. Talk box doesn't sound bad, actually.
really doesn't hurt as a effect. Um, maybe distortion. <laughs> That effect is going to get me there. Uh, distortion amp, distortion custom, resample. Let's see what frequency shift does. <laughs> Wawa. That's a guitar sound. So did we, I thought I added some vocals. Did I add vocals? Tech House Loop. Um, I didn't have vocals yet. I thought I added vocals. All right, let's just bring in maybe some vocal stabs and then that'll be it. Vocal. Do it. All right, done. I think we have. Future Gendy. Keep on. Yeah. Watch me dance. We are your future, B-Boy. 
We are your future. Maybe we take that one. We we are we are your future. 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 We 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 are your future. We slow it down. We are your future. We are your future. We are your future. Sounds like it's not even saying anything. We are we are your future. We are your future. We are your future. Uh, warp it. We are your. We are your. We are your future. We are your future. We are your future. We are your future. That maybe. We are your future. We are your future. We are your future. That actually works. So if we do that one, we are your future. And then we do one more similar. Watch me dance. Yeah. Keep on getting deep. Future music. Oh, future music. That'll work. Future. Future music. Future music. Future. 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 Future music. Yeah, let's try that. Future music. <clears throat> Save it. And then we are your future mute. Future music mute. And then one more. Future. Getting deep. Keep on. Yeah. B boy. We are your. Watch me dance. DJ. Don't stop. DJ. MC. MC. <laughs> So the only sound is this one. Future music. Getting deep. Getting deep. Getting deep. So if we do getting deep. Getting deep. What are you doing, dude? That was weird. Getting deep. Getting deep. Getting deep. Getting deep. Like that. We are your future. Future music getting deep. Getting deep. Getting deep. Getting deep. All right. I think I got enough beats. Now, if I can come up with something for our intro. Um. I don't even know what I would do. So let's say go to main. Um, <clears throat> okay, so getting deep, we are your future. <clears throat> and then something that brings us in. Keep on. Not that. Is that my first sound? Let's find out. Cat poop. Getting deep. No, it's not. Okay, cool. So I can start. 
start with this. This will be my intro. Uh, maybe slow it down a little bit. everybody off and we record this like that like that that'll be my intro And then I just need something to exit with. I can exit with that. Oh, no, I'll exit with this. So everybody find mute, and then this will be the exit. <clears throat> so the exit will go. Cool. All right, let's do some uh, sequencing, and then I think we've got a song. So we're going to start with this. So this will be the first track. And I don't know how many bars we'll do, but <clears throat> we'll start with that. That'll be the start. That's the first one. <clears throat> then from the first one, I wonder if I could bring beats in over that. This one. It goes nice. So then this will be intro one. Actually goes. That's kind of cool. Wasn't expecting that. <clears throat> All right. So intro one. drums. Yep. All right. So then this will be intro two. Actually, it even sounds like a main. It sounds more like a main, main one. So it'll go. Uh, let's go back. I never saw that before. Easy way to change pads. Wow. Never noticed that. Interesting. Anyway, um, so it goes. Let's play that last sequence again. Main one. Play. Bleeds pretty long, so I'm gonna have to uh, I'm gonna have to fix that sound, or else it's gonna interfere. Um, so it's the intro. So actually, this. 
this track. This guy. You're not nice, you're too long, bro. Alright, let's see if that fixed it. didn't fix it. So let's go into that sample. Uh, let's discard it and see if that'll fix it. Well, <clears throat> I guess I could always go here and see if it fixes it. Start one, two. Oops. Record, start one, two. Let's just listen from here. See if it cuts it off. So it does. So that's worked. Now from here, do we want to go to the background pad, this one? Or do we want to go to this background track? Nope. We want to go to sound effects. That might go. What about this one? I think I'll just bring that in because then it doesn't you don't go too far away from the the beat and it sounds pretty good so then it'll come here and it'll go kind of don't like this here, but I'm going to put it in anyway because I think it adds good variation. And sometimes you don't want people to get bored or, you know, keep hearing the same repetitive sound. So you change little things in the background. So we're going like that. What about if we bring hats in? Yep, that works. Main five, do it. So main five, main four, main three, main two, main one. So then it comes here and it's going. Here and it'll take the beat back up. 
chain six, and this will be a main six beat two. And if that's beat two, if that's beat two, then this is beat one. Oops, what are you doing, dude? I'm trying to change that name. This becomes beat one. So then we're on beat two, so it's sounding like. We are your future. So beat seven. Do it. And then beat seven will say. We are your future. We are your future. Okay, so I'll say we are your future twice. Then I should take this pad out. Bring Drum in. We are your future. And let it ride. I think so. Because then I can just build the vocals as we go. So I'll let it ride. So it'll be here and it'll be. We are your future. 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 So we'll let it say that, and then from here, we'll do future music. So let's see what that sounds like. Might be a little bit much, but future music. We are your future. 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 Alright. I think that'll work. We're on main eight or main nine? Main nine. No, it's starting to get long. So this will be main nine. Okay, so now it'll be here. Future music. We are your future. 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 Future music. Get Future music. kind of works as main 10 it'll it'll drop out or turn into a like a break and that can be like the halfway point of the the mix so it'll go enough time to hear what's going on. Am I on main 10 or main 11? Main 10, oh, main 11. So 
So then that'll give you time to hear what transition sounds like. So then we'll take that out, come back to here, and bring the drum beat back in. Maybe bring in an effect. A little messy, but I'm going to go for it because I think it, uh, it'll keep that momentum going. And then if I take this version where I'm at here and I can do a full transition to something else, I can check everything out or I can, I can bring in the ghost kick, take out that hat, take out that effect, bring that in. Let's see what that sounds like. Yeah, that'll get me back to my original, my original sounding. Uh, melody kind of sequence. So now we're back to this. And then we'll play that twice. So that's main 14. Yeah, main 14. And then from here I can go back to the the other sequence or I can do something and get back to the other sequence. So we'll do those two beats. I can drop it all the way down. So this could be main 15. That way it'll drop all the way. Everything will drop out. So from here, everything will drop out. Okay, so then it'll come here and it'll do this. Okay, and then I'll just do the final exit sound, which will be this one. And then this will be the end. All right. So that's all my tracks. <laughs> so my video's getting long. I'm going to run out of space in a minute. I better hurry up. Okay, so let's see. Main 2, so chord, main 3, main 4, main 5, main 6, main 7, main 8, main 9, 3, 4, 5, 6, 10, 11, 12, 13, switch to B, 14, 15, 16, 17. End. Did it do it? Yep, except I'm not going to end. From here, I'm actually going to go back and do um, main one, main two, main three, main four, main five, six, and then break, and then end. Oh, it didn't add them. Oh, well, that's kiddo. I got to insert them? Uh, or do I just... No, I got to insert them. Okay, so we have to insert. So insert. I wonder if I can insert them straight. Insert one. Nope, I got to insert them the manual way. Oh, that's kiddo. 
All right, so let's do insert, 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 insert. Come here. <clears throat> Change this one to one. Change this one to two. Change this one to three. Change this one to four. Then jump to six. Then jump to ten. Then jump to eleven. Then jump to twelve. Then go to sixteen. Then go to seventeen. Then go down to down to intro. What you doing, dude? We're on this one. Bring it all the way back to intro. And then that's the end. Shift save. Well, this is going to be the beat. Or at least I think it's going to be the beat. Check it out. Hey, you were supposed to echo. Check it out. 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 Check it out.
that's how it goes. See you next time. Sharp MC. Peace.